What's the fastest way to charge your iPhone or a new iPhone or another Android device? I have the answer and it's on sale and it's coming right up. Hi, I'm the YouTube deal guy, Matt Granite, and I am so fed up with bad chargers. It's really aggravating, right? I mean, your phone can do everything, but you need to keep it charged throughout the day because it doesn't seem to matter what new features and battery life manufacturers promise. The darn thing just needs to be charged every three seconds. For me, I'm capturing a lot of new action with my beautiful baby girl. And one of the things that I've realized is not all chargers are created equal. And I get a lot of questions about people asking for the best fast charger, wireless charger, QI charger. I'm going to answer all of those questions right now. There's a link located right under the video screen and those links that I have right there will always send you toward the best deals. Let's take a look first at the Mophie wireless charging pad, which is actually optimized for Apple. The Mophie charging pad uses the latest QI wireless technology. And this is actually one of the only chargers on the market where through a collaboration with Apple, Mophie has developed a very fast wireless charging standard. It's Apple optimized. So this works for the iPhone, the iPhone XS, the iPhone 8, the iPhone 8 Plus, iPhone XR. This gives you one of the fastest charges at 7.5 watts fast charging, which means 50% faster than standard wireless chargers. It's awesome, charges on contact, and I'm gonna show you right now how this is different from some of the other chargers available on the market. So these are three of the typical chargers that you will see, and they all come differently. You'll notice the Mophie actually comes with its own power adapter, so it's not one of those cheap ones. For this RAV power, you do not get a plug outlet, so you take their micro USB cable, and you have to have a charger to plug it into, or you can plug it into a, a power bar, which is what I'm gonna do right now as I show you the difference, so that's one. The second design, which accommodates the Apple Watch as well, or you just see some of these typically built for the iPhone, has the lightning connector, or in this case, just another USB connector, tied to the device itself, which for very, very weak cables is problematic because this now is almost a fire hazard. It looks like the manufacturer actually used some type of protective tape, which is alarming, but this is one of the prominent wireless charging systems on the market, and I'm just not a big fan. I'm going to show you the sensitivity now tied to all three of these. So let's start with the RAV power. Charges pretty much where it needs to be, but you'll notice right now it's not actually charging. I have it on the way it's supposed to be. And unless I move it right onto the contacts, let's try this. <laughs> this is what I run into all the time. Here we go. Come on, let's charge. Let's try it again. There we are. It's charging. It's very, very sensitive. So it's a good system. It charges quite quickly, but if you don't position this exactly the way it needs to be positioned, it's not going to charge effectively. The second uh, charge right here, let's put this on here. Again, same problem, right? It's not there, it's charging, right? So it's very, very sensitive to how it's positioned. And yes, this is great because you can charge an Apple Watch too, but if these are not lined up carefully, they're not going to charge. And again, you see a little crevice right here for the Apple Watch. The Mophie, and if you guys hear my daughter in the background, she's just chilling in a chair right now. I'm babysitting. Well, yeah, I guess you're not babysitting if it's your own daughter, but anyhow. The, the Mophie, it doesn't really matter how you put this on. It's going to charge no matter what. It's just built better. You can see it's always charging. Keep moving it around, it's always charging. So how the contacts or the wireless charge contacts are distributed in a, in a $40 product versus a $15 or a $18 product, you are gonna notice a difference. And of all of them, this is the fastest charging. So it does make a big difference. I should also mention many Android devices, and I've been an Android guy my whole life, including the Galaxy S9, S8, S8 7, S7, Edge 7, whatever it is, will charge very well on these wireless charging pads. Apple devices will charge at a different speed because based on firmware they have maxed out, but I'm telling you, this is the type of product that works for so many different people. So if you wanna score the Mophie deal right now, and you can see that not all chargers are created equal, especially on the wireless line of products, expand the video description box right under me. There you'll find everything you need. I am now, we had a crying baby in the background, so we actually had to stop our video, but Mara's good. Wanna say hi to everyone? I don't know if some of you guys have noticed, but I work at home, so a lot of the time, was that fun? A lot of the time there's a baby in the background, so I apologize. Uh, thank you for being patient with me, <laughs> shooting videos while you, while you, I'm sure a lot of you have kids and you know exactly what this is like, so we're good. Uh, the deal that you can find, again, is at its lowest recorded price. There'll be a couple more reductions tied to this closer to Black Friday, so 
Thank you for watching. If you are not yet subscribed to this channel, there is a very easy way to get subscribed. Click on my head right here, that will subscribe you to this channel. If you need help turning on your notifications or leaving a comment, just click there. And that last big round of deals I did is located right over here.